Yeah. Right now, about 30 golf course killing a man attacked and murdered on the green. It happened at Palm Beach Gardens, and police are now calling this a random act of violence. Local 10's Cody Weddle joins us live from the scene with details on this crime alert. Cody. So this happened at the Sand Hill Crane Golf Club. One witness told police they overheard the victim in this case pleading for his life as he was being beaten with his own golf clubs, and he did not survive. A vicious attack at a Palm Beach Gardens golf course leading to the death of 65-year-old Brian Hiltzabritzel. Police say the golfer was beaten to death with his own clubs. This appears to be a random act of violence where Bushir used the victim's golf clubs as weapons and viciously attacked the victim ultimately killing him. 36-year-old Junior Bushier now faces a charge of first-degree murder. Police say they don't know why he was at the golf course in the first place. At this time, it does not appear that Bushier had any legitimate purpose for being at the golf course. According to a witness who talked to police, Hilton Brittle could be heard screaming that someone was trying to kill him. That witness says Bushier struck Hilton Brittle multiple times and began choking him when they fell to the ground. Police arrived and arrested Bushier, who had stripped down after the attack. After a brief struggle, Boshir was placed into custody. Police still don't know why he may have attacked the man, but in bond court, Boshir offered an explanation. Bashir has a criminal history that dates back to 2006 for drug possession. More recently, he was arrested in 2022 for battery on a law enforcement officer and fleeing and eluding, and served 255 days in jail. So you saw Boshir there in bond court. He is now being held without bond. We're live in Palm Beach Gardens tonight. I'm Cody Weddle, Local 10 News. Okay, Cody, thank you.